What's up, YouTube? I've been watching PAL World content, you know, from like some of the big creators, from Asmin Gold, uh, from Penguin Z Zero. Um, I don't ever know what to call them. Moist Critical, Penguin Z Zero, Charlie, you know, and some other people. Then I I, I went ahead and bought the game because I have been hearing that it's fun and it looks like it's fun, right? Previously, I was not looking forward to playing the game at all when I first heard about it. I, you know, it was like, it looked like a meme. It was just like, oh, some other, some other, you know, company coming out with some game that's supposed to be like Pokemon. It's, it looks unapologetically like Pokemon. You have uh, PAL spheres, which you're, you know, you're throwing at monsters and catching them. But I, mean, I don't think we saw that before. Um, but what we did see was a bunch of like pocket monsters and uh, um, guns, <laughs> Pokemon with guns. So when I when I saw what that was, I was just like, oh, whatever. It's going to be another it's just going to be like a, some another Pokemon clone game. But you have guns now. Uh, it, the only difference is, is this is like an open world game. So uh, I didn't really know what to expect. I just assumed that it was going to be something like, I don't know, like Pokemon Legends. But you had a, but you had guns, uh, you know, going around collecting all the Pokemon having some like corny story or whatever it, it probably still has some corny story who knows i i don't i don't know the the depths of it but all i've seen is the survival aspect of it right the fact that this is a survival game that has uh catchable monsters in it uh i think you can catch any anything in it like even if they're like like human human characters that you can catch in pal spheres too um and like some other stuff and you know and oh the other big thing is it's basically arc so i heard that in the past uh they this developer the same developer made a game called craftopia and i saw craftopia and i heard about craftopia i never looked too deep into craftopia like at all i was just like oh you know it's some game it looks there's some open world survival game whatever don't even know what it looked like like except for like the the splash screen of like the, the logo and stuff that's it um didn't really go any much deeper than that so <clears throat> they made this game and so far it's had an overwhelm overwhelmingly positive response so i was like all right well i guess i'll try it out it's 26 dollars. it was like 26 or 27 dollars in the past when i wasn't working i wouldn't have been able to do that i would have just left it alone kept playing my other stuff and not even bother to look its direction maybe maybe watching some of this stuff because i'm like hmm, whatever might not have even watched it but anyway i bought it and um i played it for like five minutes just to like get a feel for what it was like to like run around and do some stuff and uh but right now um i'm going to basically start completely from scratch and we're gonna play some of this game and um We'll see how it goes because I'm still I still have to play Monster Hunter. I still got I still got uh, to learn Tekken on this thing, you know, on my on my on my kit soon. So I've been I've been doing that lately. Tekken Eight comes out next week. Uh, I bought that. So yeah, we got a lot of stuff to play always. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I probably I probably won't stream this game because like it's not going to benefit me to necessarily stream this game on Twitch. Uh, but, uh, I will like probably, you know, put some videos out here and there of me trying to, uh, move forward in this game. Also, this game has multiplayer. So depending on whether a friend of mine decides he wants to get it, cause he sounds like he might be interested in getting it. Um, I might play with him in this game and record and upload videos. We'll see. We'll see how, we'll see how Pow World plays out. Um, but yeah, let's, um, I'm going to start a, a brand new brand new game so we're going to go uh start game and we're going to we're going to ignore this i was like level five day three uh, can, can i just delete this i'm going to delete this world delete delete d-e-l-e-t -E delete to delete world delete and confirm delete enter confirm yes okay so let's create a new world uh <clears throat> uh There we go. 
island. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to name it island. Uh, uh, multiplayer, we're going to keep multiplayer. I guess we keep multiplayer off. Can we, if we turn multiplayer on, check the invite code for this world uh, on the option screen. I'm just going to keep it off. We're just going to have this as a solo world. I'm going to keep it on normal difficulty. Um, later on, maybe maybe a harder difficulty or a custom difficulty. Who knows? But this is the part that's kind of like a lot of the other survival games where they allow you to really like customize your settings for difficulty and stuff like that. Uh, we're just going to keep it normal for now. Uh, finish setting up the game world. We're also, in this, we'll, we'll, um, we're going to set up a Azeron profile. Because I wasn't really playing this with Azeron, but <clears throat> I played it a little bit on my Steam Deck and then moved over to, um, I moved over to PC, like, the next day because I was playing in bed before I went to sleep last night. Anyway, let's go to default. We're going to use my default. This is my default setup. F, E, Q, Z, R, reload. Shift, control, space, you guys know the deal if you've been here and watching my other ads around content. Escape, uh, map. So, like, uh, I'm going to, my my escape has been acting kind of, like, like weird. Like, my this back button, it, sometimes it gets, like, stuck. So, like, uh, I just, you know, from a lot of, you know, wear and tear. But <clears throat> I I have recently moved escape to, like, down. Like, so down. So, like, so I'm going to move it there. Um, I could probably still keep it here. It's not that terrible, but we'll see. We'll see how how it plays out. Make sure this is good. This is this feels good. Okay, cool. So now we have the default, and we're going to name name the character. Okay, uh, I'm gonna name it Ionia. Uh, I don't even know if that's spelled. I pretty sure it's spelled right, Ionia, because like it was close to like Ion. But it's not Ion, it's Ionia, League of Legends, Ionia, you know, whatever. <laughs> confirm. I use this name sometimes for like female characters. And confirm presets. Um Black Girl. Black Girl Magic, right? Body torso size. <laughs> uh arm size. Thick thighs. Hair. Hair, hair. A lot of these hairstyles look pretty, pretty cool. I don't like the first one. Uh, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with, go with, go with this one, go with this right here. Can I, Yeah. that one, we're gonna keep the same, I think we're gonna keep the same face. Uh, let's see. That's the face we had. This face. I'm gonna do that one or this one. I think I'll keep that face. Uh, eyes. We could change our eyeballs. Cat eyes. Kind of like the cat eyes. Hmm. Bring down the saturation a little bit. Yeah, I like that color. Here, All right, okay, we got it. Preset, okay, voice. Start game. Character customization complete. Ready to start the game. Yes. <laughs> it's 
so now we're going to kind of go through and look at the uh, controls and stuff. So she finds a a pad that looks like the thing from uh, from uh, Breath of the Wild, right? Nice little cutscene in the beginning. Set the stage. Oh, I didn't set <laughs> I didn't set it to that. Um, so we're gonna yeah, we're using default, so we have to go to. Um, why can I not reach this? We're gonna set to default real quick. Okay, oh, sorry, we got okay. Now we can go to copy profile, and then we're going to change this one to Hal World. We're gonna set it to this one. And now we should be good. Yep, there we go. So now that when I start the game, right, this is what I was talking about about your default. When you start the game, when I when I go to run, it's like okay, well now I go I go to use my my run, my sprint. My sprint is on where I exactly where I expect it to be. My jump is exactly where I expect it to be. And then we have usually your control is like your crouch button. But in this game, it is your uh, your roll button. So let's see, is C crouch? So C is crouch. So um, we can decide whether we want to keep that button as the roll button, or uh, move it, move that to crouch. So like, I can take this and I can go. Okay, we can have this button C, right? And then we're gonna move this. So that way, now my crouch is there. Now my crouch is where I expect it to be, and then we can use this as a roll button. Or I could put roll anywhere else. I could put roll anywhere else that I want to put it. Um, it doesn't necessarily have to be there. If I find that I something would be more useful to be right there later on, then I can I can just change that. You know what I mean? So then we have the first thing it's telling us to do is build. If you look down there at the bottom of the screen, so I gotta get a uh, a B button. I need a B button. And where do I want? Where would I want my B button to be? On here so I think um, I'm actually going to I think this is your inventory so I think build I, I want build to be somewhere close because I know I'm going to be using it a lot so this could probably be build right here B all right pick up fallen branches So let's see, pick up branches is F. So for me, my F, my F is on my, my mouse right here. So um, my, my mouse has this button right here that I use for my interact um, since I got my new mouse. My, on, my, on my other mouse, I probably still would use this button as interact. Um, I usually like to use my side buttons as interact because you, you use them a lot. So um so yeah, uh, options with escape. Go to the escape menu. Pal deck. That's what we've seen so far. <clears throat> Check the survival guide. Controls, keyboard. Okay, so here are all the all the menus. Build menu, throw sphere. So throw sphere. Um, you don't want that anywhere where it's uh too far away i think i'm gonna want to put throw spear throw spear throw sphere uh pow ball your pow balls um i want to put it on this button back here um aim attack we have that set already partner skill would be interact uh when it's you know i guess it's you know contextual so it would be in the interact button is f reload is r my reload is already set on my r button um, over here, that's where my reload is on all, all games when it's a reload, um, crouch, C, roll, sprint, already set, pal commands, uh, change pal, one in, one through three, and then we have change fear, uh, two, and then pal commands four. So this is what I'm going to do. Um, I think I'm going to put... Um, so this is, this is F, so I don't need this here, right? Um, this I can change to, uh, one, 
right? Wait, I'm, I'm going to make this three because it's going to go that, that way. Hold on, clear. One, and then three. That's going to be like change spheres. And then this is going to be two, and then make this four. So that's going to be my commands. Uh, yeah, I think I think I like that. And if we need anything else, <coughs> mouse camera controls, keyboard controller, game objective, what should I do first? Okay, so everything should be pretty much set. So like if I do, this is my pal sphere button. Since I don't have anything, there's nothing in my hand. My hand just looks super big. <laughs> All right. I think I I think I am going to need to change the uh I think I need to change one more thing is the rotation. I think the rotation angle needs to change a little bit. So that when I press when I press forward, I don't accidentally get cuz when I, sometimes I I'm, I'm I'm pressing here and I get this to activate because if you go right there it'll activate the um uh the left direction so like you just i just want to turn this enough so that it does not activate that left direction when i'm when i'm pressing a little bit this way you know so then this way yeah that seems that seems to be pretty good we'll see if not if not i can always i can always change it so yeah that feels better um, <clears throat> what level is that? 14? Let's not mess with that. We're, we just started the game. But yeah, like, this is, like, arc in the same way that, like, they have, like, dinosaurs just walking and roaming around and stuff like that. So let's punch some trees. We got unused stat points. Grab some wood. Uh, open the build menu with B, select primitive workbench, set the, uh, okay. Do I want to set up my stuff? I don't want to set it up up here because if I set it up up here and then I can't get back to it, I'm going to be pissed. Or like I fall and I got to like climb my way. I mean, you can climb. I forgot about that. You can climb. So maybe actually, uh, what if I set it right here? No, this is just too high. This is just too high. Um, my map button is already set, so I know where map should be. Um, plateau beginnings. I think I'm going to go, I'm going to try to work my way down here. Yeah, because I just want to get into like an open, an open area. Okay, so I think I'm going to just kind of set up here. I think set up here is fine. Build. Build this here. Uh, then we can build a club. I had, to, I had to set my, my button for uh, record pause. So you don't have to necessarily see me when I'm not doing anything. All right, let's, 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 uh, what, what's next? Open the technology screen from the menu and uh, unlock the PAL sphere. Okay, we got to go. Oh, no, 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 no. You go to. 
go to here and we go to technology and you go to pal spear and we're gonna unlock this this part is what i'm saying is like art so every time when you level up you get access to unlock more things and they give you technology points and you have ancient technology points i guess but like you you have to level up in order to unlock certain things so you can't just like have a bunch of technology points and then go all the way to the bottom and pick what you want you have to make sure you're leveling up your character by doing you know uh things in the world and then once you level up to a certain point then you can like oh you know i want to get a crusher whatever this does i gotta be level eight so i can't just unlock it or i want the poison bow so i gotta be level eight to unlock that with the poison arrows so i wonder do you need the poison bow to shoot the poison arrows poisonous target poison pals are easier to capture requires poison arrow oh okay so you can't you have to use the correct ammo for the bow, which doesn't necessarily make any sense because if you have a poison arrow, you should be able to just use a regular bow to shoot it. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, Metal pickaxe, metal metal axe down here, meat cleavers. Okay. Uh, craft the pal sphere. Where did I put? Oh, here it is. I was about to be like, where did I put my my table? All right, we need a, a palladium, a paldium fragment, um, and we need stone. All right. All right, we do get, you do get pal, paldium fragments from just hitting stuff. Is this something on the ground? Oh, there's a pal spear on the ground here, but I still need to craft one. So we're just gonna keep hitting hitting this rock until we get one. Or hit multiple rocks. Eventually we should get one. There are there are other um Paldeum like rocks that you can mine. But I don't there aren't any around here that I can see right now, but I know they do, you, you, you can get them out of rocks, so I'm just going to keep hitting these rocks until I get one. We just got one. Nice. Okay. So I got a bunch of stone. I got a uh, Paldeum fragment. I'm going to go up here and craft my first Pal Spear, and we're going to catch, catch our first uh, Pokemon. I guess we go catch one of these chickens. Slap. Ooh. How did... <laughs> How did this game do catching po catching monsters better than Pokemon did? <laughs> All right. You won't be able to effectively use pals at, uh, at a higher level than you. Your, their abilities will be lowered to match yours of your character's level. Okay, and they got they got balancing going on in here. All right, what's next? The open the technology screen for the menu, unlock the PAL box. Uh, build a PAL box in an open space. The surrounding area will become your base. Um, access the PAL box and summon a PAL to your base. Okay. So it's not here. We can get we can do a pickaxe. Pickaxe and a and an axe. Five, five, yeah, we can do that. We're gonna make this real quick. And then make a axe. Alright. Oh, we almost didn't go pick it up. Okay. Now we got an axe. We got a pickaxe. Uh, and a club. Um, let me go. Let me go get this ore. Cause since it's right here. I don't even know what to use ore for right now. But I'm gonna grab some. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna build a pal box like right here. 
Um, where is it? Pal box. Yes. Also, campfire unlock because and wooden chest. Uh, repair bench. Give me that. Um, I'm not even gonna. I, I will, I'll wait. I guess wooden structure. Because when I want, when I want to start building stuff, I'm gonna need a pal bed. Um, I need a bed and bow and arrow. So that we unlock all of this stuff. Um, I might need this stuff later. Repair. Oh, repair. Are you sure you want to unlock a repair kit? Yes. Because I'm gonna need it for the repair bench, I think. Or actually, I'm not sure. I think you need repair kits to use them at the the uh, workbench. But maybe you don't need them for the for the repair bench. I don't know. We'll find out when we build all this stuff. All right. Um, build. Oh wait, we need to be building a pal box. What do we need for a pal box? Wood and uh, paldium fragments. Okay. Uh, time to hit these rocks again, but we got a we got a pickaxe this time, so it won't be as slow. Yep, just got one. And we got some ore. All right, we got like three paldium fragments. Uh, gonna build. Oh, we gotta build. We gotta build a uh, what's the name too? Um, I think I'll, I think I'll build. It's probably a bad idea because I can't build that way. It's only gonna. I think I'll, I'll build a pal box like right here. Um, where is it? Build. We still need. Oh, we still need wood. My axe. All right, now I'm carrying too much. <laughs> I'm carrying too much, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna build. Uh, I think I have enough. I should have enough wood to probably build a box too. So I'm gonna build this pal box right here. Oh, this will take up some of this. Some of the space. So build this in the open area. Build a pal box like right here. Oh yeah, I forgot you can um you can use your you can use your pal. No, I didn't want to do that. I just wasted I just wasted a ball. Um E. We need E. I don't have an E button, do I? Um I don't have an E button. I need an E button. Where do I want my E button to be? Uh, I guess here. Yeah, I guess here is fine. E. So he can help build. He should build, right? Can he not build? Can the chickens not build? I guess the chickens can't build. Maybe because they don't have any arms. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, and I do need a campfire. Build that right here. Oh, you can you can cook stuff. Oh, one out of two, one out of two. Let's let's do one of these. And then we're gonna do one of these. Now we we're warm also. So since we're we're hungry, we got food now. Um right click it. Wait, am I am I still hungry? Oh no no, it, it, it replenished the food a lot. That's your hunger bar. And you gotta feed your, your pals too, so um Yeah, I'll just I'll just give myself that. Okay. You gotta access the pal box and summon a pal to the base, which I think is just doing this. Yeah. You just leveled up. Open your inventory tab. Strengthen your stats. Capture five land balls. Then earn XP bonus. Uh, uh, increase your player level by capturing thirty pals. So that's that's gonna be a long one. 
It's gonna be a long one. So we gotta we gotta get a lot of resources together and um make a bunch of power balls. We gotta enhance stats too. Um I I think <clears throat> so I think I want to increase um weight limit. I'm gonna increase weight limit to four hundred right now. That's what I did first when I started last time. Because you end up having to bring back a lot of, like, resources. And your bar goes up pretty fast when you're, like, hitting trees and stuff like that. So I'm going to... I do need to make a box, too. You need a pal bed. You need a storage box. A storage box. Um... I need to catch something that has arms. Because, uh, the chicken ain't cutting it. Put all the rocks and stuff in there. Put the ore in there. I'll keep the rocks on me because I might need to build something. Keep the palladium fragments in there. Uh, so, <clears throat> I assume they have something that's like a uh, refrigerator. Like a food box that you can put food in so that it so that it doesn't spoil so fast. Because Ark has one, so I I assume I assume that they have one too. <laughs> Mission complete pal box upgrade available. Seems like a visitor is heading toward the base. A visitor is heading toward the base. Oh, V? I don't have a V button, do I? I'll just throw V over here. Uh, Max Pal's working at base. Max number of bases. Deploy a Pal to work at the base. Build a wooden chest. Alright. Next thing to upgrade is build a primitive workbench. We did that. And then build a shoddy bed. We should be able to do that. I need wood and I need wool. So I have to go kill a lamb ball and get wood. Oh, I need a pal ball. I need some pal balls. I don't have any. Um, I need wood. Oh, a lamb ball. Okay. Oh crap, I didn't even make the I didn't even make the ball yet. No, no. Oh my god. Come back. Get No. Don't kill it. I need it. <laughs> Don't kill it. Wait. Okay, here we go. Whew. It, it had no health. It had like no health left either. I mean, I did need some wool. I did need some wool. I've got some good items in stock. Pal balls. Arrows. So I heard you can catch humans, right? Let's try it. 
for science. Oh! I'm sorry. I'm chill. All right, wait. Just, just think about this. Wait, just hold on. Hold on now. Let me... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get him. Get him. All right. Maybe if we could have... I don't know if we could have apologized. I'm sorry. I can't... I can't... <laughs> Visitor has left the base. All right, I'm trying to like, we gotta get like, get rid of the body. I just wanted to see if I could capture him. I can't, I can't take his stuff. So he's gonna, he's gonna get rid of the body. Yeah. Cool. That never happened. All right. Uh, I have one point. Um. I guess. Uh. Work speed. Work speed is not really that important, I don't think, because you can use your pals once you have a bunch of them to. Uh... I'll just go. I'll just go. Wait. I'll just keep going. Wait for a little while, and then maybe. Oh, stamina. Stamina too. Stamina. Is, stamina will be important. Stamina you're using literally all the time. Get one because I'm gonna catch that dude over there. Um, and let's make a bow. <clears throat> See, I would normally be able to make one of the pals do this, but I don't have one with arms yet. All right, and we need some arrows. I guess, like, that should be enough. All right. <clears throat> I had some weird issue with the first half of this video. Um, let's get, let's get <clears throat> rebalanced here. Uh, eat that. Okay, my, my hunger is over here. 66. Cook that. I have wool. I have six wool. What did I need that wool for? I need it for a bed. That's right. I need to make a bed. Right, we're going to make a bed right underneath this tree. Wait. I still need more wood. Okay. Uh... I think that should be enough. That should be enough. I'm gonna put it right here. Oh yeah, I can. Oh, you can rotate it with the. Uh... Can I not put it here? Oh wait, it has to go indoors. Build it indoors on a foundation with a roof. Oh, okay. So I have to build inside. Okay. Um. Oh, I need to go get it. I need to get it from, um, wood structures. Common shield made with plenty of it repairs itself when not taking damage. <coughs> Stone spear cloth outfit feed box place food and pals. I hit these will feed eat from it. Okay. Structures, alarm belt. Build it. Sets an alert status for pals on base. Change pal behavior to either attack, invading enemies, or focus entirely on work. Whenever you like. Structures. Hanging trap. Catches pals that pass through. Only effective on small pals and humans. <laughs> What else do I have? Um, it needs ten palladium. I don't. Do we need? I don't know if we need shield right now. Okay, but we do need to build. 
foundation. Okay, so all the wood structures are available from that one thing, or at least um, most of them. I think in, in Ark, you had to get them all separately, but they put them all together here, so that's pretty good. Um, we're going to uh, put this here, I guess. Put that here. Um, stairs. Attach these stairs here. Um, how much do we, oh, oh, we, we got plenty. We got, I think we have plenty. Wood wall. Or wall with a window. You got a roof. Got to put another wall here. Let's get this out of the way. Axe. Axe. Okay. Alright. Should be able to put a little wall here. Uh, I think... Actually, can I... I'm gonna break this. I'm gonna put another foundation here. Do I have enough? Wait, can I not put it here? Too close to a special boss facility. Can't build. Oh, because it's, I guess, too close to the, um. So we're going to break this wall out. And we're going to put the door portion back here. Um, god damn it. Uh. I think that's gonna break the wall. Yeah. Whatever. That's fine. Um and we're gonna put we gotta put that window wall back here. Window wall. Put another window wall here. Wall. Just build build a little two by one. Then a roof. No, you need we need uh Now, should be able to put the roof here, right? Right? No, I want to put it... There we go. No, 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 no. Roof. Dude. <laughs> yep. Oh, okay. No. Oh, this is annoying. Just put the roof. Where is it? There it is. Okay. I just wanted to put a roof on the place. Jeez. Okay, now we can put the stairs back. Do we have another overlaps with other objects? What other objects? I just had, I was about to say, I'm like, I, it must have been me standing there. I was like, I just had the stairs here. Bro. All right, now, do we still have enough for bed? We don't. We have to go get more wood. Okay. All right. Bed. Um, 
build your base till it reaches up to level seven. And we need to capture five land balls. Okay, so now we now we now we're just gonna go build. Uh, we built a bed. Let's sleep in. I think we need to sleep in it to um, save our location. I think. Will it make it nighttime? I think it, or does it make it morning? Not sure. Maybe it makes it morning. Like it advances the day. All right. What is in here? Gonna put that away. We got one pal sphere. We got some wood. We got stone. Uh, we can put that fiber away. We'll put the wool away. Put the gold coins away. Oh, I never picked up my I never picked up my arrows. Um Oh, outfit, we need cloth. And we need uh Paldeum fragments. All right, uh I don't think I got cloth from the um technology tree. So, let's get some let's get cloth. I assume that we're just going to have to end up like use building everything if most of the if we need it. Maybe maybe the first 3 levels. It seems like we need everything, so Let's do spear. All right. So cloth. What do we need for cloth? How do we how do we make? It's cloth here. Okay. Cloth wool. Oh. Okay. So wait. I think the only. Okay. The only wool I have is in the box. So stuff works as long as you have it around. So you don't have to keep. So I don't have to keep all the stuff on me. I can put all of this stuff in the box as long as it's in the base. I assume. That's great. That's actually that's actually great. <laughs> um, yeah, that's that's actually really good. Okay, so I'm just gonna build two, I guess. I don't know if I need any more. All right. Um. Okay. Yeah. Just two. It was two. We're gonna build one of these. Then we got ourselves some clothes. Alright. Now we got now we have clothes. Now we look now we look cooler. Alright. What else do we have to build? Workbench, repair bench. I guess I could put my workbench and stuff in here. Um, can I use? Can't be assigned. Wooden foundation. Okay, yeah, yeah, there we go. Now, now we're working. Now we got them working. Okay. So, I need to capture more land balls. He's in there working on that. I, I'm going to move. I'm going to move my... Uh, can I just break this down? I can just hit it, right? Oh, God. It's a thousand? Wait, maybe Axe will be better. Yeah. I mean, I could just put another one in there and leave this one here, but I think you get the resources back from it. I think. I think so. I think. Do we get resources back? No, we don't. We don't. So that was that was stupid. Okay, whatever. Um. Just build another one in here. You have enough wood. It's only cost it only costs two wood. That's probably why you don't get any resources back for it. Um I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it like right here. Why will it not let me put it right here? <laughs> Wait. Turn it around. Oh, okay, okay, okay. My bad. I, I didn't realize it was backwards. Oh, he was already coming in here to, to work on it. 
Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Are you gonna be able to get out? Oh, well, I guess I could just call you back. Duh. Awesome. Good work. All right, I'm gonna make, um, see how repair kits, repair kits, make a repair kit and I'm gonna make a spear. And a spear. All right, choir. All right, let's see how repair kits work. I swore there was a there was a thing for repair. I guess since we have item management, tech repair, durability, stone axe, repair. Uh, did we repair it? I I guess so. Okay, that got repaired. Repair. Okay, it just doesn't update it right now. So to repair this, I need two more stone. Let's go whack two stone real quick. Is is this does this count as a stone? It does not count as a stone. Okay. Uh, let's go over here. Oh, there's two stones sitting on the ground. Nice. <clears throat> Oh yeah, I guess we don't need repair kits. I guess we don't need the repair kit. Can I use the repair kit? Um, security settings. Oh. Lock activated. So I guess this would be for other people. Like if other people were to come in, then it would it would activate the lock. Okay, cool. I mean, we're not on a multiplayer server, so it doesn't really make a difference. Might as well make a torch. Cause I haven't done so yet. I mean, so far, so far, the game feels like a solid survival game. Like, it feels like, it feels like what I would have wanted Ark to be. Because Ark, though Ark, to me, is like a, like a good game. Like, a lot of people like Ark. Um, they came out with that, the new Ark that's updated, and it's like, oh, well, uh, you know, pay $40 for this game again, but just on a different, um, just a different engine. I think it's Unreal 5 engine. But the game doesn't really, like, run well or it doesn't install well. It uses up a lot of space. Like, I don't know what it is about that game, but, like, it's always a pain in the ass to run. And it's huge. It takes up an enormous amount of space. Um, but in it, this game, it looks more fun to play because like i guess because the art style and the way the way it is and like the monsters are like little cutesy monsters or whatever and uh, i guess that that would appeal to more players and more people um like i'm glad it, i'm glad that it's not like just a pokemon knockoff where it's just like oh let's just do the exact same thing pokemon is doing um with with monsters and and catching them and just make a story that you walk through and play like with a single player experience that's what i thought it was i thought it was like a single player game you play through the story you catch monsters and then you raise the monsters to fight people like fight each other and i'm like that game's not gonna last because if people want to play pokemon people are gonna play pokemon but 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 the most recent pokemon that came out i don't know man i don't know how anybody's playing that game um i have it and i tried to play it and i played through some of it it's just it feels very lazy and it feels very um um it feels very early access like it feels it feels like an early access game that they're passing off as a full release 
on Switch, and it doesn't. It's not good. Like it's not. It doesn't feel good to play. The frame rate is not good, and people blame the Switch for that. And I'm like, you can't really blame the Switch for that because the Switch. It's only made for Switch. Like why? Like why should it not run well when it's only made for one system? Usually, that's a problem when like when like games are ported over from another system and they're like uh they didn't port it over well and now you have um this problem where the game like the game doesn't run well because they didn't they didn't take the time to make sure that it runs right on the other system or that it runs right on pc or you know that the the graphics are set properly because you got to change it over from other stuff like you know what i mean like you only have one system to worry about to make sure that it can run on. And on consoles, that's the easiest thing um, when you only have to deal with one system. Like you don't have to you don't have to have the different the different like um, infrastructures of like Xbox and PlayStation and and switch and PC and then PC having like a ton of different um like PC having a ton of different ways that people configure their systems and all that kind of stuff like. You don't have to worry about that. We don't have any food. We don't have any food. I gotta go kill this chicken. What? Uh, is there a shield here? Is this? <gasps> I'm gonna die? What? Excuse me? Um, okay, so I, I don't die. Oh, I almost touched the fire. I would I would definitely about to die. Um Is there any food in here? Oh crap, I don't have any food. Uh what if I sleep? Can I sleep off the hunger? Do I have anything that I can I don't think I have anything that I can cook. I do not. Um um why is that one why is that one <laughs> That one chicken. Oh, that's because he's. <coughs> that's because he works for me. <coughs> I can't kill him because he works for me. Okay, so I have one HP right now, and uh, I need. I need food. So it's time to hunt. I, I definitely need to hunt some hunt some pals to eat. I can also get berries. There is also berries and stuff to eat, but I don't see any right now. There, oh, there's some right there next to the, the pal that I can hunt. But I'm going to eat these berries first so that I can regain some of my health. Hopefully he doesn't attack me. Oh, there's tons of berries right here. Awesome. I'm regaining health very slowly, but better than nothing. Berry seeds. So I can plant seeds for berries. But I I do need to I do need some lamb chops right now. Do need some lamb chops. <clears throat> I do need to hunt lamb balls too, so hmm. I mean I need to catch them. There's a pal spear. Nice. Oh, oh, okay. So I definitely was over here before. I or at least I think I was over here because I definitely remember that. I don't know if they. I don't know if they have seeded things or is the map the same. The map might be the same, and you just place you at a different spot. Hmm. All right, we got we got two two pal balls. I'm gonna capture. I think I'm gonna capture. Oh damn! I guess I'm not capturing him. Oh, he died too. What did I do? Crit them? Whatever, I have food. 
I do need to go eat. I'm gonna get some of this palladium. I'm gonna just call it palladium because uh that's what you that's what I think about when I see the word. And and, and palladium reminds me of the uh the stuff that Iron Man used. Oh no, don't waste the freaking ball. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna switch because this is what I mean by like hitting stuff by accident. Where it's like, okay, I I hit this. I'll I'll hit this by accident. This is fine to hit by accident because it's just my my land ball. But when I want to catch something, I have to be deliberate about what button I hit. So, yeah. Let me um. <clears throat> also, this this um. Effigy. Enhances your ability to capture. Oh God! This is so. Can I use a repair kit like out in the in the? I can't use a repair. Oh, maybe I just drop it on here. You can't do that. So do I ever need repair kits? No point in repair, right? Maybe if maybe if. Let's try putting. But I can just build a repair bench. Let me see if I build a repair bench over here real quick. If it let me use this. So what's the point? I don't, I don't see the point. Repair kit. Oh. Oh, it's to repair. Okay, 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 okay. I understand. I understand. <laughs> 30 seconds. I could have just built another one. I could have just <laughs> built another pig eggs. Uh, let's repair this. Now we got these over here just in case. Just in case I ever need them and I'm back when I'm over this way. Might as well build a campfire over here too. I just I just need to I need to cook food. Might as well, right? A little mini outside base. Uh berries. Baked berries are probably better than regular berries, right? Um, let me, let me see, though. I wonder. Uh, fire, cancel. Let me see. Our, our baked berries. Okay, we use these. We're at 19. 34. Okay. It was at 20. It would have been at 35. So it's, uh, 15. And then... So we went down one, up to 55, 34, 35, 15, 35. So yeah, I mean, it's, it's five more, like it's five more, but you know, it is what it is, you know, it's, uh, feed them the berries. All right. Oh, mic wire. I need a longer mic wire, actually, so that I can put it underneath the desk. Uh, yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Now, I have one. <laughs> I have one pal spear. Let me go over here and uh, I think I can, I think I got stuff to make pal spears. I think I got enough, right? Axe, I mean pickaxe. I'm 
Wait, can I make two? There's a boss. We got how many? We got two, two down. Need three more. Oh, I don't have any more. Oh, I never picked them up off the table. Oh my god! All right, <laughs> I never went. I never picked them up. That's fine, because you're coming this way. I don't have any arrows. Spears. <laughs> Alright, just got some stuff for some pal spears. How many can we make? Four? Nice. Alright. That's how I picked them up this time. Um Oh, see, I'm not cold. I'm not cold because I have clothes on. Oh wait, I can't jump. Don't I have a don't I have a torch? Did I make a torch? I probably didn't pick it up off the table. Of course. Let's see how much stuff I have. Um wood stone. I always need that wood stone. Food. So I know how much stuff I have. Making some arrows. Make it. I'm gonna make a couple. Probably not gonna make the whole fifteen. I'm gonna make a couple. I just need one more land ball. <laughs> gonna head back to the base real quick and uh, sleep, and then wake up. Maybe there'll be some land ball spawned over there somewhere. Let me spend my stat points. Uh, how many do I have? What? One. Let's stick it in stamina. I'll start putting stuff in stamina because um, I think that'll be important, especially for climbing, running, and fighting and stuff like that. Yeah. Stamina is going to be important. Case of point. <laughs> Ooh. Gold coins, arrows, nice, and a copper key. <laughs> I wonder, is there fall damage in this game? I'm not sure. Oh, well, there probably has to be. Right? Maybe not. Or maybe you have to fall from really far. I have no idea. Uh, Wait, what do you need, bro? Hungry? How do I, how do I feed the dudes there? Oh, I need a feed box.
feed box. I need wood. Food in there. Okay. Oh, don't walk on the fire, please, God. Um. <clears throat> I need to make a bed too. For for the pals. Food box. Can he, can he like, can you, can you eat? Will he eat? Cannot feed box can't be assigned. I thought he could eat though. I guess I could just feed him flat out, right? But he should be able to eat from the box. Or does he not? Let me see if. Oh, okay. Wait, is he eating? I wonder, is he eating the regular berries or the... I'll take these out. Okay, he's eating the berries. Good. Good. Eat up. Alright. Uh, Base upgrade. Next thing for base upgrade. Build straw pal bed. Three of them. need a bunch of wood and fire. I have enough fiber. I just don't have enough wood. I need. Yo, all, all the trees in the world, bro. Should have plenty of wood as I'm carrying way too much. Um, we're just going to slowly walk back over here and we're going to build pal beds. Maybe I should build a chicken coop. I'll just build, I'll just build the pal beds right here. I think it probably will make me build them inside. Oh, no, this. See that. Can't be built in this area. Okay, you know, we can build them outside. Okay, just build them <clears throat> right out here behind behind the house. Well, multiple ones. Oh, no, we can't put multiple out. Okay, so they, they call them back. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, need three of them. Alright, cool. He's gonna start building those. 
can leave him to build there. Uh, we're going to put these away. We're going to put these and these away. The seeds. Coins. Or. Wood. I guess I can put that away because I don't really need it on me. I do have the torch on me. Maybe he'll walk. I think he'll come in here, too, and, and start doing that stuff. Good job. Good job. They look good. Let's see if he goes in there. I think he will. Oh, that's cool. That's good. That's I, I like that. There's So there's another game. <clears throat> now, I'm not sure if there's other uh, I'm not sure if it's Survivalist. I forget because I played Survivalist with a friend of mine. But, I, but I'm pretty sure the, the, like you can have little monkeys do stuff, but I think you had to assign them to one thing. And if you assign them to that thing, they would only be there to do that one thing. They wouldn't move around the base and do other things that need to be completed. So that's good. I like that, especially because you can only throw out one of them. So you can throw out one, and he can go around and start working on stuff. That's pretty cool. Um, and you can just kind of like set stuff up that you need, and then you can come back, and it'll be done. Um, is there any more stuff in here? Food? Okay, we could put more, put more berries in here. Wait, wait, put more berries in there. And then, um, I'm going to cook the rest of this stuff. You do this base upgrade, build a berry plantation, uh, deploy a work, deploy a work pal to the base. Oh, we have one. We have one work pal. Build campfire, build berry plantation, deploy a work pal to the base. All right. We still need to capture one land ball. Um, I'm going to go back over on the other side. Oh, wait. Oh, he's RK. Whatever. <laughs> still need to get capture one more. Um, let's put... Can... Does he... Will he work? Oh, okay. Certain ones work. I forgot. The chicken can't work because the chicken doesn't have any arms, but they they can work. So we'll put yeah we'll put we'll put these guys to work. All all four of them. We got four slots. They're all going to be working. Do your do your stuff. We can go back over here now and uh, see if we can capture another another land ball. I already see one right over there. Oh here's yeah good. They respawn nice. Uh, did I do I have arrows? Yes I do. Oh, he dodged it. Oh. Level up. Meat. ourselves a cad tiva all right it's time to head back over to base and then uh see collect all the stuff that they that they got together i thought i think they're gathering i think when they're not doing anything else i think they just go gather which is great work work ethic <laughs> all right i want to see i want to see if there's fall damage Ugh. There's fall damage. It's not crazy, though. Grab the arrows off the table. Appreciate that. Is How much stuff is in the feed box? Did it eat it all up? No, not yet. Okay, we're going to cook. Cook this stuff. Somebody going to come over here and cook it? Any one of you guys know how to cook? Alright, 
so far, so far the game's the game's been pretty solid. I mean, I, I know I'm only in the beginning and I haven't done too much, but you know, just doing like the opening missions and, and you know, uh, catching stuff, catching stuff feels good. Like I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the the sound effect of the ball hitting, and in like the 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 little UI thing of like it it catching and and like knowing how much of a percentage it's going to be for you to catch something. I don't know. It feels good. It feels good. Um, you know, having all the tools, crafting, and all that kind of stuff. The survival aspect of it, building your your like the art style looks good. Like. It doesn't look like amazing, but like it, it doesn't look like it doesn't look like shit. You know, some people, some people may uh, say that it does. I may, maybe, but I mean, the numbers don't lie. Like there's, there's a lot of people playing this game. I think the game sold like a million copies, which is insane. But uh, yeah, so uh, let's see, let's see how the game goes. Um, I'm trying to get at least to a point where I can. Um, craft guns and stuff we'll be able to craft guns how far down is that this is the tundra outfit this is the new outfit um poison poison crossbow so it's pretty it's pretty far down so here's a makeshift handgun so that's level 25 handgun 29 <laughs> like i want to get down to some of this stuff single shot rifle Refined metal armor, shotgun, assault rifle, pal, pal metal armor, heat resistant pal metal armor. Down here we have rocket launcher, rocket ammo. I know I skipped some of the guns. I probably skipped some of the guns in here somewhere because I think there's an SMG too. Maybe mounted machine gun, the glider. This looks like a similar to a glider from Fortnite. Uh, ice mines. Ice grenades. Is there an SMG? I swear there was an SMG. Storage container set. Can store items. Place in a base to improve mining efficiency of pals. Fine bed. Handgun ammo. Giga shield. Maybe there is an SMG, but maybe that's just the assault rifle that I saw somebody with. But yeah, I'm, I want to get down to some of that stuff. Here's the mega spheres. And I assume, oh, well, actually, some of these items are unknown. So. We don't. We won't know what they are until we get down to them. I wonder if they show you what they are when they get to that level, or if you just have to take a chance and just click on it and unlock it and see what it is. Um, but yeah, maybe maybe the SMG is hidden behind one of those. Oh well, here is our answer. Unlocked after a certain pal has been captured. Oh, okay. So you have to capture this. The incentive to capture different different pals, so you can see what what will unlock. Egg incubator. Place the pallet inside to incubate it. Uh, this is ancient technology. Small feed bag. What else is down here? Pal essence condenser. Combine several pals of the same type to create a higher ranked version. Ah. Mega grappling gun. Average feed bag. Hip lantern. That could be useful. Definitely. Um, single shot sphere launcher. So you can ca so you can capture stuff from far away. <laughs> Scatter spear launcher. Improved launcher that fires many spheres simultaneously. Can easily capture a herd of pals. What? Decal gun set. Fires pal spears that automatically home in on pals. Requires weapon assembly line to craft. Okay, I mean the stuff down here toward the bottom. This is this is where this is where it gets uh, 
you start unlocking guns and a better armor and stuff. Circuit board, ultra sphere. We can capture like bigger and better monsters. Oh man, I can't wait to get like mounts and stuff. This 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 game actually makes me feel good. This game makes me feel good about playing it. So did Ark, but like now now there's more people playing this game and it runs better than Ark. It also has multiplayer, it has like dedic I think it has like dedicated server. I think you can make your own server on your computer. You can you could probably be able to make a server on like um one of those server server websites where you, you know you can rent a server stuff like that. I don't know about all that yet, but I assume that if they're doing the same thing Ark is, then it's probably going to be the same thing. And then with everybody that bought the game and they sold so much, more stuff to come, more more DLC, more uh, more items, more expansions, stuff like that for the game. Um, let's see, let's see what they do. Let's see what they do with this game. All right, it's been it's been good. It's been a long one, but uh, games games pretty good. I like it. All right, I'll uh, catch you guys later. Peace.